So how do you nurture those networks? Do you basically go out of your way to help people until you reach a position where they, they want um, help? So, so, I mean, the way I nurture, you know, my networks is I, I think, you know, I, I guess, and I, I definitely believe that I'm a natural born leader. Um, so I, put, I do put myself out there where I lead um, and I, I, in the example of PPE, um, I established basically like, you know, in, in WhatsApp and Telegram, there are people who create these group chats yeah. and the people who create these group chats then have a responsibility to ensure that, or at least I think they have a responsibility to ensure that there's no scamming, there's no fraud yeah. happening under, under their watch. Yep. Now, a lot of people didn't give a shit. They just created these chats so they could make a lot of money, right? Um, I obviously created these chats to make money. But at the same time, I took admins who were willing from other chats, who were willing to start um, a society together of cleaning up the industry. So I created this, this you know, society of um, around 100 administrators of Telegram, WhatsApp, Facebook, all these PP chats who were willing to clean up the industry because there was a lot of fraud. Um, and, and what we would do is we would have this, our own little group chat for, you know, around a hundred people. And every day we would submit people that we think were scamming. Yep. And if we agreed, if we had a majority, we would add them to a list. And then we would also take their, you know, we would write down a list why, you know, we thought they were either, we call them a joker broker or a scammer okay. um, or a fraudster. And then we would share this list with the community. And not only that, we would remove any of these people from all of our chats. And we would have, we had like 50 chats together, right? So it was a powerful thing. You know, we were cleaning up the industry. Now, I think, you know, we, we have a responsibility of not only making money, but doing good. Absolutely. So I think that's one way to nurture your network is by being, you know, honest and helpful and and people then will look to you as someone they can trust um and and throughout the pandemic you know everyone would come to me michael have you worked with this guy yes i have good deal don't worry about it no i've never worked with him no I, he's not even my phone be careful no he's on this list definitely walk away so like you know people would come to me um looking for my you know advice to to transact with people because so much money was flying around and then even more so, we would have like these fake courts and um, fake appeals where people could come and appeal the fact that they were on the list. Um, so we, we developed like this community, um, nice. you know, you know, to to ensure that so many other people, thousands of other people wouldn't get scammed. And I think that's, you know, being a leader, you know, like I think that's one great way to nurture your network is to, to go out of your way to ensure your network. Um, is yeah. okay yeah you know is is it okay and it's that you're not just looking to take stuff out of them yeah you know sorry it's <laughs> <is> so funny <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so yeah so um you're not just looking to take everything from them you know you're looking to give out more than you get it's like sort of like being a mentor you know and and and, and um i pride myself on that